Welcome back everybody to Make Sure Daily and today we're going to do another five minute Lego challenge. So let's spin the wheel, the maker wheel, and find out what we're going to build today. It is a bridge. I love building bridges. It's difficult with small pieces. You want to have really long pieces to build a bridge. So let's see how I come up with a good bridge solution to the problem of having very small pieces normally. Um, okay, let's jump right into it. A bridge, we get to build a bridge. That's fantastic. Another architectural kind of feel to it. Um, love these architectural items. So how are we gonna build a bridge? Let's put five minutes on the clock, see what we can make. So let's start with the body of water. So we got a little pond there, we gotta build a bridge over it, right? So maybe we do something like that, or maybe, well, we're probably gonna need these for the bridge. Hmm. Or maybe it's just simple. Maybe it's just this and that. There we go. So now we got our body of water that we need to build over. So I always like arched bridges. So we're gonna try that. Um, so here is probably the start of the arch bridge, right? Something like that, because you can definitely, I mean, that, that alone is a bridge. Are we done? <laughs> We're one minute in. That could be a bridge, um, but that's not what I'm looking to do. Maybe, maybe a little more support, huh? Give me a little more support along that I, same idea. Right, something like that maybe. That's better. And if we have a bridge, you gotta have a ramp to go up it and over it. So how are we gonna ramp up and over? So we need some slant pieces. Uh, we got one there. We got these here. Okay, got a little bit of those. I'm not used to working with these too much though. And we got these. So we definitely can use these. And a little bit of that. There, so that kind of fits the look and the style of what we're looking for. Not the right color, but at least the style and the, the look, right? So we need a little more foundation, foundational support here. Under here, make sure that we're all built up. Uh, I'd like to add a little more color choices here. Kind of like a cobble or a um, stonework that's kind of starting to break up a little, right? I'm not liking this being here, unless we do two of them, which we can. We got that ability. So this is gonna be a fake one. It's not gonna be structural on the back here. A little secret tips. You don't have to have it 100% structural in order to be able to finish your design. So we have a lot more time. We got two minutes left. So I'm gonna put some flowers down by the river and see. Structurally, yep, not secure. <laughs> um, also, what if we put some railings? That give it a little more depth, a little more height to it. Um, make your eye kind of go in the places that we want it to go. So we got some sort of railing you can walk across, hold on to the railings if you need that kind of thing. So let's do the flowers though, now that we have a little more time. Maybe there's some bigger bush kind of sunflowers growing down here, right? So maybe something like that. We're gonna spend the rest of the time with that. Now, you know, we could have, we could have took the easy way out, right? We could have used these. 
I mean, these are a nice little arch that would have done, would have made an you know, arched uh, bridge, but I, I, I didn't want to do it that way. I wanted to kind of piece, piecemeal it together and see what we could come up with together. So now we're doing flowers down here at the bottom. And you want to give it a little more depth. You don't want it to all be all in one line like these. You want to give it a little more feel to it. Maybe it's a another flower up here. Christmas tree? No, I didn't want a Christmas tree. Maybe a little little bushes. Maybe there's some bushes around the back side here. And we're up. Time's up. So I you know the color scheme isn't correct. You know, there's a lot of browns, a lot of uh what color would you call that? Uh, a magenta? Yeah, probably a magenta. But anyways, it still looks like a bridge to me. It's got the water coming through it. Maybe if we wanted to, we could have done the water like this, maybe? Yeah, that, lo that looks a lot better, actually. Um, but the water runs through underneath the bridge. You got the railings on the bridge. If we had more of these pieces, we definitely would have added them, right? Or we could have done one side, the structural side, we could have built up that that side of the railing. But to each his own, one way or the other, um, it, it's a nice looking bridge, I think. And we're gonna probably put more bridges on the wheel. So tune in if you like these kind of things, these architectural series within the five minute build challenge. Okay, thanks everyone. Thanks so much for watching. Here at Make Share Daily, we love to make things, especially with Legos. So these five minute challenges are a lot of fun. And if you wanna play along, go ahead and pick up this classic Lego box with 221 pieces. You can pick them up for about $15 at your local Walmart or Target, and then you can play along. Or just use any other Legos that you have at your house. As long as you build that same topic, find a way to share it with us on all of our social medias. I'll leave it with this. Please go ahead and make something and share something each and every day. You'll be glad that you did it and we would love to see anything that you make. So find a way to post it to us on our Facebook page, our Instagram page, or our Twitter account. And you will see all the links down below where you can get in touch with us. So thanks everybody for watching and we'll see you tomorrow to make something new. See you later. Bye-bye.